I have a small haul from Salvation Army. They had 50% off of things from September, dated September 25th and before. <clears throat> and then I had a coupon for 25% off. So I got a little bit off of stuff. These were only, oh, these were 50 cents. So I'm going to use this white candle in that deer thing I got, whatever that thing is. Antelope. Antelope. Deer thing, yeah. So I thought that was pretty good. I think these are from Luminescence. Not Hobby Lobby? Might be. Not sure. So, 50 cents on those. And then, uh, got these pinking shears. Are they Wiss? No, they're Japan. they're Japan, which isn't very good, but it's better than China. Um, these were $2.99. I use these when I cut my uh, crepe paper stuff. I have some, but I don't know where they are. Let's see. These are right-handed ones. So I have to suffer through these. So $2.99 is okay. Or you can make... Um, shorts look like hillbilly bottoms. That's like right, or werewolf shorts, you know. Yeah, hillbilly. Like that, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice. So there's multi-uses for those. And oh, I got this. I love this little box. Look at this. Oh, huh. It is a activity uh -huh. set. And so this was a dollar ninety nine, but I love it. <laughs> I used to love these when I was a kid. And look. Something's on. broke off, but... Oh. That's all right. Shepherd or something. Is that in here? Oh. No. Hmm. Yeah. Too bad. That's all right. Maybe I can get like a little Pokemon and glue on there. Yeah, just find anything. Yeah, just like a little Pokemon or something and glue it on there. Be cute. But I like it with the box. I think that's really neat. So, awesomely cool. It's got the star. Mm. Yeah. So you don't, I used to find these all the time, and now, mm, not so much. And this is really cool. I really like this. It's a whale, and he's mercury glass. Let me pull this off. <coughs> That's his blowholes in the wrong spot. <laughs> That's where they, it, they mercury glassed him. Mm. Uh, this is his blowhole spout mm -hmm. thing. You know, and he's got this neat. This is the glitter I was looking for, and the guy at Costume Supply said, "Who did he say bought it?" Uh, oh, uh, not Alexander McQueen. Hmm. Some big designer bought the rights to this glitter, so you can't find it anymore, which I think sucks. It wasn't Versace; it was somebody else. I, I love this kind of dark tarnished glitter. You used to be able to buy jars of it, but I got this for a dollar ninety nine. So I think he's really neat. Very, very cool. Oh no, it wasn't. Okay. Um, it wasn't. Uh, oh, Gautier. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Gautier bought it. That's who he said. I don't know if that's true or not, but and I found this box. And it was like always look in the boxes. This one said bubble lights. <clears throat> so this was four ninety nine, and then I got. 25% off, so it was like $3. Um, hopefully these work. You know, we're always using these for things. Mm -hmm. They're cool, vintage. <clears throat> yeah, sort of vintage. Well, yeah. Yeah. I think you could still get these at, like, costume display, but they're more than $5. So that's neat. Three something for that. And I got... They were sneaking stuff out as I was, shop as I was shopping. I got this thing of yarn for $1.99. It's Red Heart. It's my favorite. So this, I think this is a better red than the red I got. So, put this in stock. Two bucks. And Mr. Retros was wishing for some votives, and bam! There they are. These are Cedar Vanilla Spice mm -hmm. and Fall Splendor. Sounds they were two ninety nine. Where are they from? Made in Vietnam. Uh, I can't tell. But they were two ninety nine, and they were they really smell nice. <clears throat> I can smell them right through the package because they got these little holes, blow holes. Like, mm -hmm. and then I got this bowl because I think it's really nice. 
it looks like it's handmade. I'm not sure if it is or not. I like the glaze. I thought this would be good for chips. I'm always looking for a large bowl for chips. And it was half price, so it was a dollar and a half. Let me pull this off. There's no signature. I don't know if they made this. I don't know. It looks handmade to me, but I don't know. They could be tricky. They could have made it in a mold, but I don't see any mold lines. They could have been turned, or it could have been a coil pot. Hmm. I'm not real sure. Either way, I like it, and I think it'll look pretty with some chips and things. Or, or you can you put other things in it. Mm -hmm. See, the outside's just kind of sort of matte with a little bit of glaze. I don't know. It's a mystery. And then the last thing I got is this. Oh, I wish I'd found a, like a whole box of these. <laughs> I love these. Mm -hmm. I've had these off and on over the years. <clears throat> and I get them, and then I said, oh, I don't want them. And then I sell them or give them away. And so now I'm on the collecting side again. So this is $1.99. They used to do kits, I, you know, of these different kind of ornaments. This doesn't look like a kit one exactly, but I'm not sure. But it's neat, see, and then sometimes you could put like a whole bowl of them like that. Yeah. That's what Stray Cat does. She puts a whole bowl of these out. Nice. Yes, very pretty. So that's what I've got for today. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.